What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. I'm Deja. Hello! So today's video, I'm gonna get right into it so I don't have to ramble that much because it's kind of like a lot but a little to talk about. The biggest thing which this video is about is my hair. You guys, I'm in a little predicament. I don't really know if I should cut my hair by the end of this video. You guys let me know if I should just do another big chop or if I should start taking tips and tricks on growing my hair and if you guys have some of those let me know but like I said I'm not gonna be rambling a lot I'm getting ready to go wash my hair I'm also a huge thank you to formulate for sponsoring this video I'm also getting to the brand and all that good stuff and how it's been helping my hair and stuff like that but yeah if you enjoy these type of videos or would like to see more hair videos on my channel make sure you give this a big thumbs up and like I said I'm gonna need you guys help so I need you down in the comments because I'm going to be reading all of them um, if you're a natural girl or if you're transitioning or if you straighten your hair a lot and don't care like me a little bit um, I'm gonna need you in the comments because I need y'all to help me out I don't know what to do um, I don't know my hair is so bad it's gotten so bad and I tried my hardest tried my hardest I got my length but like the curls I don't know how to properly take care of the curls so i need y'all help okay i'm gonna stop talking and we're just gonna get right into the video so you guys my hair is very dry as you can see super damaged i'm trying here um the middle only curls a little bit and you're gonna see that but with the formulate shampoo and conditioner you can tell that my curls are trying like this is their shampoo it smells so good and basically i'm gonna just explain what formulate is while i'm washing um it's exactly what it sounds like it's a formulated shampoo and conditioner made just for you you have your own personal chemist also have an app that makes it a lot easier for you to go in and tell your chemist um about your hair and your hopes for your hair like for me i have very thin hair it's super dry um my curls semi there <laughs> and my scalp is non-sensitive so what i ask for in hopes of getting my hair to where i want it to be is i want hydration i want to define my curls strengthen my hair add volume and length so right now I'm washing my hair for the second time um their shampoo you guys I don't know what it is it shook me the first time it leaves your hair super soft like it doesn't feel like it's stripping your hair of anything it actually feels like it's adding stuff which shook me the first time now this is their conditioner you guys I love conditioner as you can see I add a lot <laughs> um this is in the scent peach mango and I got both my shampoo and conditioner in that scent and I wanted it strong so it can be there all day you don't have to get a scent if you don't want it or you can change your scent you can make it light medium or strong but you know me <laughs> um the ingredients that I have in my shampoo and conditioner was recommended by my chemist which is sesame seed oil sweet almond oil and vitamin b5 which was all like I said recommended to help me get to my hair goals um which was hydration volume all that good stuff you know so if you guys want to check them out like I said I'll leave everything in the description down below I'm honestly loving their products as you can see like I said the middle of my hair the curls are trying to come through um the shampoo and conditioner have been helping me I'm really just gonna start taking care of my hair because this makes me so sad so 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 sad but formulates helping okay <laughs> so after i get out the shower my hair typically looks like this it has gotten progressively worse over the past month um because at this point i'm kind of like a i don't care phase i wear my hair out naturally because it does look really really weird and really really bad the back as y'all can see back is straight i feel like all this is straight this part is a little more frizzy then this side, um, so yeah, what I've been doing is recently, if you're loving this brand, um, Melly's Rice Water Collection, this is their moisturizing milk, and then I use Ozzy Miracle Curls just to, um, you know, trap in the moisture. Stuff smells really, really good. Um, I have like three other products by them that I really like. Um, what I was thinking about doing, and you guys let me know down below if I honestly should, um, I did do a big chop and put oil in my hair before it dries. So I did do um, a big chop, what I would say like two years ago. Did the big chop two years ago. And um, honestly, look, this makes me so sad. <laughs> like so sad. You guys are probably at home watching like just cut that sh off, honey. But um, so yeah, back to what I was saying. I did the big chop two years ago and I had straightened my hair one time um for the very first time a year like exactly a year later because i wanted to see how 
long my hair has gotten and all that great stuff. My hair itself have gotten longer, but it looks really, really bad. Like, it's just honestly dead hair. I my hair for the first time exactly a year after um, my big chop and ever since then my hair got deep damage like that. Like my curls were never the same after that. Um, I used to have really tight coily curls, um, pretty much like 4B, 4C hair and ever since that first time it's never went back to how it was that whole year before me straightening it and I literally used a straightener with like 140 um, degrees. Like I didn't go past 140, I used it on the lowest setting because I was so scared. And so yeah, now the past month I kind of was like, I really don't care and I've really been straightening my hair. Last month I kept it like completely straightened the entire month. So yeah, I just want to know your thoughts. My thoughts were because when I was um, growing my hair out the first time I did my big chop, um, I used a specific um, conditioner and shampoo brand um, also with my rice water treatments like every two to three days type of thing. And my hair grew very, very fast and a lot. And then what I was putting in my hair after I would use the rice water was just water and conditioner. Like I didn't put anything else other than like eco on my edges, but that's pretty much it. And that grew my hair out. So my question for you guys before we end this video is should I um, just do another big chop and cut it off because like the ugly stage, oh, that killed me. That killed me, that killed me. But I could just get wigs and protective styles and stuff like that. Or should I just start doing um, what I was doing in the past and start chopping slowly at the dead ends while my new growth comes instead of just like com cutting it completely off. So you guys let me know down below. Again, I would like to say thank you to Formulate for sponsoring this video. Their shampoo conditioner works wonders. Um, it's actually helping the curls, the curls that you see come back a little bit. I think over time if I continue to use that because I have been having the formula shampoo and conditioner that's all I've been using for the past like three months. Um, I like to use products before I tell you guys to make sure they work on me and how I like it and give my honest feedback. So I've been having that for like three to four months. So everything I said in this video is my true honest opinion. All my natural hair girls out there, y'all are probably looking at this like girl cut your hair off. But um okay i don't know about right tail. <laughs> i'm gonna just continue to use this their shampoo and conditioner with my oils and my deep conditioner i have the rice water mask that goes with this collection that i like to use after i do washes at least my hair is super soft but their shampoo and conditioner like my hair is super soft so i'm gonna just let this air dry um but yeah, I will be in the comments talking to you guys. Please leave me your tips and tricks. Um, what helped you? A lot of you guys are coming to me like, what's your tips and tricks? And y'all, my tip and trick was honestly, honestly just water and conditioner. That's what grew my hair. Water and conditioner. That's all I put in my hair. Like, all I put in my hair. I will wet my hair and put conditioner in it every day. I don't know if that was healthy, but it worked for me. <laughs> so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Um, I will leave all Formulate's information in the description box down below at the top, so make sure you click that. And on that note, I love you guys! Bye!